So uh, a pastor and two women in Nigeria have been abducted by ISWAP, who some of you may know are an offshoot of Boko Haram and are the Islamic uh, State Western African province. So they were abducted uh, by Boko Haram and the group have released a proof of life video on YouTube yesterday, October 29th, the report says. In the video, the pastor, who is named as Reverend Polycarp Zongo of the Church of Christ in Nations, asks for help securing both his release and the release of the two women. Uh, suka kama ni a hanya yanzu nan ina hannun su sun kuma kama wa'ansu mata Krista guda biyu su ma suna nan ina roko ku taimaka domin a ciciren mu daga hannun su so ISWAP have been known to kidnap and kill Christians when ransoms are not paid the terror group abducted and killed reverend Lawan and Dami, District Chairman of the Church of Brethren in Nigeria in Machika County, Adawama State, earlier this year. They also executed 11 Christians on Christmas Eve last year. It's unlikely that if the Nigerian government does not secure his release, he will be murdered on video as propaganda for the brutal group. The two women, however, are more likely to be kept or sold as slaves to supporters of the group. So what I would say is the Reverend uh, who was referenced as earlier being kidnapped, his hostage video was one of the reasons um, that cemented my desire to speak about Christian persecution. You may remember me referencing it at him at earlier times. He asked for the forgiveness of his captors. He was killed and it's pretty unusual that Nigerian um, ISWAP or Boko Haram hostages are released unharmed. Um, unless it's of course into slavery or some other form of um, subjugation. So what I would again ask you, I know it's repetitious, please do pray specifically for the people involved in this case. Also pray for Nigeria as a whole, but most importantly the Christians there. So I also ask you to pray for Boko Haram and ISWAP. It may seem a little counterintuitive, but they certainly need the Lord more than uh, most other people um, when it comes to having the scales removed from their eyes and the Holy Spirit poured out upon them. Um, in order that they cease persecution of our brothers and sisters. So please do pray and uh, share this video, like it, comment, and uh, if, you, if you focus your prayers, God can give you individual ways in which you can help. All right, God bless you, bye-bye. Not while I'm doing a video, I'm not now. Nah. <laughs>